All right, so another little quickie on the 4.3 Vortec, putting the distributor back in. I put a compression gauge over here in the number one cylinder hole where I could see it from inside because I don't have anybody here to bump the engine over. So I went inside, bumped the engine, let it uh, build up a little as soon as I seen it building compression. Come out here to look at my timing mark. Lined up the timing mark with the balancer timing mark here and uh, on the cover. So now I know it was top dead center number one. Come back here to my distributor. Drop the distributor in and on these Vortec ones they got the little arrow right here on the casing and this is a non-adjustable housing. It's not like the old ones where you can just unloosen this clamp and turn the distributor housing to time it. This one pretty much is slotted on the actual housing where the clamp will not move so you bolt it down and when it's down flush you have to make sure you're lined up with this. Now the first time I dropped it in, the oil pump rod down there was turned a little and I was a little bit off. I knew if I went and bumped the engine and the distributor would drop in as soon as it matched up. I came back around and actually I lined it up with the compression gauge again to make sure I was on top dead center out here on my timing marks. Came back over and I'm lined up here. So now she's pretty well in time. The computer will take care of the rest. Time to go ahead and put the cap on and uh, get the plug wires on it. Let me see if I can fire it up. 